What's up you guys? Welcome back to Business Buzz where we focus on business, entrepreneurship, and investing. Today on Business Buzz, we're going to be talking about Robinhood and specifically the new Robinhood cash management feature. But before we get into the video, make sure you go down and subscribe because I have a startling statistic that I'm about to tell you guys. 98.6% of our viewers are not subscribed. So once again, please go down and subscribe. Let's get into it. So first of all, if you've never even heard of Robinhood Cash Management, or if you just heard the name and you don't even know what the heck it is, uh, let me tell you what is it. It lets users park their uninvested cash into sort of a savings slash debit account. Uh, you know, you can pay, you can use that money that's uninvested on a car that they give you, and it also earns interest. So basically, you know, if you have $500 on Robinhood and you put 400 in the stocks, that extra $100 can be used on your debit card, not to mention it earns interest. You guys might be wondering how much interest you'll be earning, and it's kind of an interesting question to answer because for a while you would be earning 1.8%, which is super high for something like this. However, it just recently went down to 0.3%. But honestly, that's still better than nothing. I mean, it's it's better than just having your uninvested cash just sit there, right? And I'm pretty sure the CEO said that he wants it to go up to 3% at some point. So if it does, that, that'd be quite honestly amazing. And let's not forget to mention that these accounts are insured by the federal government, so you don't gotta worry uh, about your money. There are no account minimums, no transfer fees, and no foreign transaction fees, which is pretty good. Keep in mind, you can withdraw your cash from over 75,000 ATM. So again, it's just like a debit card. Another thing that's really cool about the cash management is that you can actually pick from four different cards. And I obviously this isn't a huge thing, but it's kind of cool. They have a green card, a white card, a black card, and a USA flag card, which is the one that I'm probably gonna roll with. Again, this works like any other debit card. You can use it anywhere that they accept debit cards, and you can even get a routing number and an account number, just like you have a bank account. So it sounds all nice and wonderful, so let's talk about all downsides to this. The main downside that I could find in this uh, cash management feature is the poor customer support that many customers experience, probably due to the fact that this is just such a, a fast-growing company. So yeah, you know, Robinhood support is not the best in many people's eyes, but I do predict that it will probably get better as the company becomes more established and just kind of slows down a little bit. Of course, another downside is that the interest rate, you know, just completely flopped, of course, you know, so maybe you'd be kind of scared of the instability there. Maybe you're expecting a 1.8% and it goes down to 0.35. That's a pretty big jump there. However, keep in mind that 0.35%, while it does sound really tiny, it's still bigger than most banks out there like Charles Schwab. So guys, in conclusion, even if you don't really want, you know, another debit card to carry around and you're not really that interested in it, it's still like a one of those why not things. Like if you use Robinhood, why wouldn't you use this? You know what I mean? Why wouldn't you use this? All your uninvested cash will be earning interest. You don't have to use the card if you don't want to, but you'll be making extra money. So it's like, it's like why not, you know? This is just another great innovative thing from Robinhood, honestly. I honestly think they're a great company so far. They've been making a lot of great forward thinking choices and just cool things that they're adding to their, you know, business. It's it's a really cool company and I'm pretty sure they're IPOing soon if they haven't already. So it might be an interesting stock to look into. Another thing that I want to add is that their apps user interface and the cash management, how it's integrated into it is beautiful. Like always with Robinhood, they're great at that and cash management is no exception to this. It looks great. With that being said, that's really all there is to say about Robinhood cash management. Again, it's a really interesting thing, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'd love for you guys to go down and comment below any future video ideas that you'd like us to cover. Again, it could follow anything to do with business, entrepreneurship, entrepreneurship, personal finance, investing, whatever relating to our type of content. We'd greatly appreciate ideas. Anyway, that's about it. We'll see you guys later.